All right, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. And today, I want to quickly address a question that a lot of other global players have been asking me recently. And that question is, how can I get all 55 of the guaranteed LR tickets to do my free guaranteed LR multi? And of course, in today's video, I'm going to tell you guys exactly how you can get your hands on all of these tickets to do that free multi. But before we jump into it, I do want to be very, very clear that we can't actually get, we can't actually get all the tickets right now, all right? Because this whole, you know, ticket collection thing is supposed to be something that we do progressively throughout the entire celebration, right? So while we can get a good amount of them right now in part one, the remaining tickets we need to complete the set and do the multi are actually locked behind part two and part three tickets, or sorry, part two and part three missions which of course are not available yet and will come later this month, right? So as long as everybody is aware of that and we're on the same page about that, then we're good to go. And uh, let's move on to the Dokkan Wiki now and talk about how we can get these tickets, okay? So the first way that everybody should have gotten their tickets very easily is through this initial login bonus. So a couple hours after the anniversary started, we got a couple copies of this Goku, 45 Dragonstones, as well as five of the 55 special summons tickets in our gift box. So anybody keeping count, that's five in total at the moment. And then we can move on to these part one missions and we can get a bunch of tickets through the limited missions here. So the first mission is to obtain one skill orb. Of course, you can get them through the Whis training event. So if you do that, you get one ticket for a total of six, um, you know, including the five from before. And then the second mission is to obtain five skill orbs for one more ticket. That's a total of seven now. And then if you equip one skill orb to a character, you get another ticket. That's eight. You equip five skill orbs. That's another ticket for nine. And if you clear a stage with a character that has a skill orb equipped, you get another one. That's 10 total tickets now. And then moving on to this mission right here, if you clear the In Search of Greater Power God Level Intensive Training event, which is the Whis training event five times. You get one more ticket for a total of 11. And then if you clear the Zero Mortals Plan event, which is the Zamasu event five times, you get your 12th ticket. If you clear it 10 times, you get your 13th ticket. And if you clear the Saiyan trio led by Fate, which is the you know Kid Saiyan from the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie event five times, there's your 14th ticket. If you clear it 10 times, that's your 15th ticket. And if you clear the A Promising Recruit Frieza's Army Enlistment, Enlistment Test, which is that punching bag style event you have to clear with, you know, units from different categories. If you clear that five times, you get your 16th ticket. And then if you raise a character's super attack level to three or above, that's your 17th ticket. If you raise to five or above, that's your 18th ticket. And then seven or above, 19th ticket. And 10 or above, uh 20th ticket all right so finally we have a couple of missions here just for consuming stamina so it's one ticket for 100 stamina that's 21 200 stamina 22 300 stamina 23 400 stamina 24 500 stamina 25 and then 700 stamina this is actually supposed to be two tickets if you check in the in-game missions so we're up to 27 so this is a bit of a typo it should be two tickets but in total from the missions in part one as well as the initial login bonus here you can get 27 of the 55 special summon tickets okay now moving on to the uh frieza's recruitment or frieza army enlistment test event you can actually get a ton of tickets through this event just by doing all the stages right so uh so far at the time of filming this three of them have come out the movie heroes, movie bosses, and time travelers. Actually, no, I think four. Patara, I think, also came out. But, um, you know, if you're watching this the first day, then there might not be the fifth one. But essentially, you can get four tickets for clearing each of these stages just one time, right? So four times five, that's 20 tickets right there for clearing this entire event. And that's 20 tickets plus the 27 from before. So that's 47 total tickets. And that's essentially all we can do or part one of the anniversary, okay? So once part two rolls around and we can actually do the part two missions, let's uh, check those out. So just keep in mind we're at 47 right now. We can get a few more through the missions. So there's one mission here for clearing the Wii's training event 
one time for our 48th ticket. And then there are some more stamina missions. So it's consume 100 stamina for the 49th ticket, consume 200 stamina for the 50th ticket, consume 300 stamina for the 51st ticket, consume 400 stamina for the 52nd ticket, consume 500 stamina for the 53rd ticket, and complete all 5th anniversary missions, which is basically all of these missions. Uh, to get your 54th ticket, right? So to get this 54th one, you got to complete basically all these other ones that precede it. And at this point, we'll be one ticket short of the multi. So, of course, the last ticket is locked behind a part three mission. And all you got to do to get this last ticket is to clear any stage five times. And we get that 55th and final ticket to perform our free multi-summon on the 55 unit free guaranteed LR multi-summon banner. That was a really long way to say that name, but you guys get the point. This banner right here, you can do your free multi with all those tickets we collected throughout the anniversary and get your guaranteed LR. So there you go guys, that is today's video. Hopefully it was uh, helpful to some of you guys who have been a little bit confused or curious about how these tickets or actually work or how to get them. And uh, if you guys have any questions about anything that I said in this video, any of the missions, then feel free to let me know in the comments down below and I'll try my best to help you guys out. But I think for the most part, you know, the different missions and the ways to get them and all that stuff is pretty self-explanatory. And uh, the biggest thing is to really just be patient and wait for the other missions to come out before we can, you know, complete the set, right? So uh, that's it, guys. That's all I got to say. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.